So I've been working on my project of transferring a recording studio workstation over to Ubuntu Studio from Windows 10. And today I approached the point of one of the first big make or break moments. And that is to see if my quote unquote unsupported Yamaha MG 12 XU mixer will be recognized by Ubuntu Studio. And I was extremely pleased and relieved to find out that Ubuntu Studio recognized my Yamaha MG 12 XU mixer. And it seems to be working just fine. Let me show you. I did have to right click on the little speaker at the top and configure audio devices to make sure that I was actually selecting that correct input and output uh, MGXU device. For the sake of this test, I'm just using Ardour and I will later be installing Studio One Six, which is supported on Linux. And there you can see it, MGXU, and that's the left and right. Since there is no Steinberg Yamaha audio control panel because there's no proprietary drivers installed, in order to change my uh, buffer and my frequency, I have to use the Ubuntu Studio Audio Configuration panel, which is under uh, the main menu in Ubuntu Studio Information. Once you open that, just select Configure Current Audio Configuration. And this is where you enter your buffer size and your frequency. Basically just two numbers you can see here. Example default is showing 1024 by 48,000. And uh, basically I just switched mine to 512 by 48,000, which is uh, 48 kilohertz. You can see here that it is also set in the routing grid for the audio inputs in our door. And then in order to set your bit depth, you actually can just go right into the session menu, click properties, and then on the media tab over on the left, you will see the audio file format. I'm gonna be recording in 24 bit and using WAV files. And now for the final test to see if it will record. Unfortunately, I don't know any good Taylor Swift songs to sing for you on the demo. So I'm gonna do the next best thing. If you want my body and you think I'm sexy, darling, won't you let me know? How's that? That's some Grammy-level stuff right there. And if you care to hear that abomination one more time, just to make sure it worked. If you want my body and you think I'm sexy, darling, won't you let me know? Coming out of those speakers. In order to get the playback to work, I had to go to my master track and click on outputs. And down here on the hardware tab, I actually had to go in and enable the routing for uh, playback left and right for the MGXU. So I definitely still have a lot of testing left to do. I have no idea how this thing's going to do with latency and things like that. I know that there's latency adjustments built into um, Ardour, and eventually I'll get Studio One installed, and we'll see kind of what happens from there. But this is a good sign. This means that at least one of my pieces of hardware are being recognized and are usable by Ubuntu Studio. In the next video, I'm going to test out my Steinberg audio interface and see if I can get that puppy going in here as well. So stick around. Make sure that you give a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you then.